The capacitor is one of the main components in a ceiling fan. This module starts the motor on its highest speed and, on pull chain fans, it can work in conjunction with a speed switch to change the fan speed. If your fan speeds are no longer functioning correctly, it may be time to replace your capacitor. In this video, we will show you how to replace two common types of capacitors with step-by-step -step instructions. If you are replacing a 3-in-1 capacitor for a pool chain fan, continue watching. If you are replacing a starting capacitor for a remote control fan, skip ahead to the next section. To replace the 3-in-1 capacitor, you will need a wire stripper, wire nuts, electrical tape, a pick or similar pointed tool, and a replacement capacitor ordered directly from customer service. Before getting started, turn off power at the breaker. You will need to disassemble the light kit to access the switch housing where the capacitor will be located. To make the replacement process easier, you can also bring the motor down from the ceiling and place it on a stand. Unscrew the grommet to free the speed switch. To release the wires, insert the pick or pointed tool into the opening for one of the wires. Pull the wire out of the switch while pressing the flap down with a pick. Use the process to remove the gray, brown, and purple wires from the speed switch. Use the wire stripper to cut the red wire and the other gray wire. You can now remove the defective capacitor. Bring the new replacement capacitor to the motor. Strip the previously cut red and gray wires. Combine the red wires from the capacitor and the motor together and secure them with a wire nut and electrical tape. Repeat the process for the gray wires from the capacitor and the motor. Insert the purple wire into the number 3 slot of the speed switch. Lightly tug the wire to ensure it is locked into place. Insert the brown wire into the number 2 slot. Finally, insert the gray wire into the number 1 slot. You can use this diagram for reference. Slide the speed switch into the hole on the switch housing and secure it in place with the removed grommet. Carefully tuck the capacitor and wires neatly into the housing and verify that all wires are properly connected. You can now reinstall the ceiling fan using the owner's manual for reference. Then return power to the fan from the breaker. Congratulations! You have successfully replaced the capacitor in your pool chain ceiling fan. If you still have issues with your fan, contact customer service for assistance. To replace the starting capacitor, you will need a screwdriver, wire stripper, wire nuts, electrical tape, and the replacement capacitor ordered directly from customer service. Before getting started, turn off power at the breaker. On some fan models, the capacitor can be found in the light kit or switch housing. However, most starting capacitors will be found on top of the motor assembly. Disassemble the fan to access the capacitor. To reach the capacitor in the motor, unscrew the top housing screws and remove the top housing. If the reverse switch is attached to the housing, unplug the 4-pin connectors. Remove any screws holding the capacitor in place. 
Use the wire stripper to cut the white wire and red wire from the capacitor. You can now remove the defective capacitor. Bring the new replacement capacitor to the motor. Strip the previously cut red and white wires. Combine the red wires from the capacitor and the motor together and secure them in place with a wire nut and electrical tape. Repeat the process for the white wires from the capacitor and the motor. Carefully tuck the capacitor and wires neatly into the housing and verify that all wires are properly connected. Reassemble the motor housing and secure it in place with the six removed screws. The ceiling fan can now be reassembled using the owner's manual for reference. Then return power to the fan from the breaker. Congratulations! You have successfully replaced the capacitor in your ceiling fan. If you still have issues with your fan, contact customer service for assistance. Thank you for watching.